Hi all, welcome to my video. Today in this video we will be working with this model. It is rather simple but it contains nice features of surfacing. That's why I want to model it for you. First we create a new part. And on top plane we are going to create a sketch. And we draw here one circle. Which have a diameter of 100. And then we go close sketch. Now we create a new sketch on white plane. Then I take a line from here. I end it up here somewhere. Then I click it. Convert to construction geometry. Now control is pressed. Point and the circle selected while it's pressed. And this appears. So it is possible to drop here one another circle now we just determine our point in fact and then uh, we close our sketch now we have two sketch and we go surfaces swap surface I select this circle first and then the second the big one and then we created this form it's looking like a donut now on the right plane we create one more sketch and I do something like this if you look from the working plane you will see something like this this will be here coincident and I select point and select the circle and I say while my control is pressed concentric then we can convert this one to a construction geometry now this is my pad i select swap and i will select from here my pad and at the end we will have something like this but later on we go here options profile twist specify twist value revolutions and here i say 60. and i close it we can hide one of the surface body and at the end you will get something like this then I will come here I will go sketch intersection curve select these ones and select this one as well and then I click the OK and then everything will be converted to a 3D sketch. It's good. We close this by using two set of surfaces. We create simply a 3D curve. It is very convenient comment. You will use it when you are surface modeling. It is good to be aware of it. And then later in this plane, I created here one more circle. And we come features, swap, this is the profile, and this is the pad. This is enough to select one of the line. Whole uh, set of curve will be recognized by program. And it is now busy with modeling it. Take some time. And then we get the preview. And we can say OK. And then the operation is done. It was a simple but contains really nice little features. Uh, thanks for watching. If you like it, please hit the like button and make a comment. See you in another video.